this is continuation of the uh, previous video sequence extraction from a set of sequences in this one uh, we're going to talk about a uh, few methods to filter out sequences based on the characters they have in the sequence so sometimes what happens when you uh, receive these sequences from a database or whatever uh, resources they might have certain characters uh, which you don't want to uh, handle for example in this in these sequences i have introduced uh, x and ends in uh, certain places so if your sequences have uh, some sequences which you don't want and because they are not a good quality have a lot of ambiguous spaces or ends or some characters which programs are not able to uh, handle uh, one of the options which we have is uh, to filter out sequences containing certain criteria under sequence option uh, you have option to either delete them or cut them open the clipboard or cut them into a new alignment I'm going to use cut them to new alignment so we can see what was the effect of our uh, action so in this one uh, they have a lot of different filters which you can use uh, the first one is uh, if you want to filter your sequence based on certain certain uh, string certain uh, bases for example if I want to uh, uh, filter the sequence with uh, an ends, multiple ends here uh, just remember that if you want this whole string to be treated as a one stretch of string not individual characters uh, check mark here and so I'm asking the by edit to select every sequence which has these many ends, at least these many ends. And if I say remove, it is going to remove those sequences which has ends here and put them into a new alignment. That's the option I chose to extract and save them into a new alignment. You can save this file as a new file. I'm not going to save this one, and then I'm going to do undo something other than these ones so if I say select the sequences with n and x and I want to treat each individual separately so it is going to select every sequence which contains other than n and x and what it uh, essentially means that a t g c are non n x so literally every sequence will be selected and extracted so let's see and everything disappear from here and move to a new alignment because any sequence which has other than n and x so it has a that qualifies for non x or non n character and it selected all and extracted i'm going to put it back all the sequences into the file the other option into uh, for filtering out sequencing sequences containing certain characters uh, you can do based on uh, percent of gaps uh, for example if you do an alignment and uh, some sequences which have a lot of gaps which don't align well with other sequences you can mention here that you want uh, at least 50 percent or any sequence containing that particular percent of sequences or less than that should be removed or greater than that actually removed uh, you can also uh, use option where you can say um, <coughs> if the sequence has uh, this many gaps in the start or this many gaps at the end uh, remove that uh, these are very useful in the alignment sometimes unrelated sequences they end up uh, uh, showing up a lot of uh, gaps because they don't align well and those are troublesome sequences so you can use these options to remove them uh, one of the very good uh, option here is to filter the sequences based on the length and often we need um, during processing or analysis that we want to keep for example uh, cds's which are larger than 1 kb or larger than 500 bases so for example if i say i want all the sequences which are larger than for example um, let's see 1000 bases i don't know how many i have but let's try and if i do it is going to remove everything which is less than 1000 bases out and only leave the sequences which are 1000 bases so here the largest one i have is the 500 uh, four bases which is less than and i'm going to uh, not going to save this one and if you check the original file every sequence has to be more than uh, 1000 so this is the smallest one here which ends up at uh, 1179 
so that's a very useful function uh, by it has you might need it uh, more often than you think same way you can uh, remove sequences which are uh, shorter than particular uh, length so here it is going to remove sequences which are longer than or that number so if I say again same number 1000 bases and what it is going to do is remove all the sequences which are longer than 1000 bases and leave the one smaller back into uh, the original file uh, so in the previous uh, option these were extracted out and larger than 1000 were left in this uh, function these were left and larger than 1000 were kind of extracted out I'm going to bring them back using Control Z. Uh, 